Did you ever think that there could be a Nigerian Ryan Seacrest? Meet Mike Adekunle, famously known throughout Africa as Mike Magic. See how his 15 years of entertainment experience has blossomed from a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity in Lagos. My name is Michael Olubumi Adeola Adekunle. Probably a few more because I'm a Yoruba boy, but I'm also known as Mike Magic. <laughs> Growing up in Nigeria, in Lagos, was actually a lot of fun. Um, I learned a lot because I got to interact with a lot of different kinds of people who came into Lagos. And I think that's what inspired me to have an open mind and to seek out my passion in media. I was involved in media in different ways. I acted in TV commercials and music videos. I presented TV shows and radio shows. The pinnacle or the height of it was when I hosted Idols West Africa. Yeah, I'm the West African Ryan Seacrest. My Idols West Africa experience was really awesome. I got to travel to different places in Africa. It was nice to see all these people with dreams come out and try to be the next superstar. I moved to the Washington DC area because, hey, I'm into entertainment, uh, into media. Um, America is the center for entertainment and media. And this area in particular is actually very good. You're spoiled for choice in a way. Currently, um, I am already pursuing my passion in media. Um, I have my little setup right here at home. Um, I'm doing a show that I'm putting on YouTube. It's called The Treatment. Okay, The Treatment is my baby. It's the first uh, project that I'm really doing here. Um, I get to critique and uh, celebrate entertainment as a whole. Beyond media and entertainment, uh, I keep uh, up with my culture through my food. Apart from food, um, I'm very proud to wear my traditional attire when I when the occasion calls for it. Usually for like weddings or you know, formal occasion, I wear my buba, which is the the top part, like the gown, the shirt. The shokuto is basically the trousers. Um, and if it's really special, I'll wear the agbada. It's a really big garment that goes on top of the buba. It's got, some people joke and say it's like a parachute, it's like wearing a parachute, but it makes you look really majestic and really kingly. My goal uh, here in the United States is to make my mark in the media and entertainment field. I intend to become a household name. What a fun story. Here in the studio today is Nafi Sonicon, a DC TV student producer. Thanks for joining us. Thank you, Mallory. That looked like a really fun story. Did you guys enjoy yourselves? I thoroughly enjoyed speaking with Mike. I thought he was just an amazing person with a great story. Yeah, I like his bright smile and his like upbeat personality and energy. Yes. So what were some of the most interesting elements of the interview of his story? So I definitely really enjoyed learning about Mike's story, mm -hmm. um, specifically, how he was able to get a once in a lifetime opportunity to host a show. Yeah. You know, we think about how all of us may go to an audition and <laughs> how I'm sure there's tons of people who want to host American Idol here. Right. And he actually got the chance to host Idols West Africa. So I thought that was just something so inspiring and, and exciting. That's, I like his branding, his African Ryan Seacrest. Yes. That's awesome. And he's done tons of things all over Africa. Yeah. So I just thought it was interesting to see that blossom. Mm -hmm. um, and I also just found really exciting, um, you know, I'm also Nigerian, so okay. when he was talking about all his cultural you could um, experiences, to I really related to him. <laughs> so that was exciting for me yeah. as well. Yeah, so what did you learn specifically from Mike? So like a lot of young people in America, I think a lot of us are trying to follow our dreams. Yeah. And I thought that Mike took a big risk by coming to yeah. America. Right. And I think that, you know, it taught me to take risks and go for my dreams. And sometimes that involves stepping out your comfort zone so and making a sacrifice um, and making a sacrifice yeah. so I was really inspired by Mike and I thought he taught all of us to just basically go for it um, and hopefully I think he's doing a lot of great things in DC that's awesome well it's really fun talking with you and thanks so much for sharing your story 
Thank you. Or Mike's story, rather. <laughs> Thanks so much. Mike Adekunle is a young immigrant who came to the U.S. with a mission to take the media industry by storm. He has already started with his new show, The Treatment. He is an inspiration for any newcomer trying to get a piece of the American dream. For more information about Mike Magic, visit his YouTube channel, Mike Magic Presents, or check out GetMagic's profile, Tumblr.com.